Hello everyone, my name is Vidhi Janeja and I am from team Fantastico and today I am going to speak on the topic Importance of Public Speaking. Today my daughter and my daughter is going to speak on the topic of Sundrai Ho Dosto, yes, my daughter. और यहाँ पर बेटी बैक स्टेज खड़े हुए अंदर ही अंदर सोच रही थी पता नहीं स्टेज ढंग से बोल भी पाऊंगी या नहीं अगर स्टेज पर जाके सब कुछ भूल गई तो अगर कुछ ढंग से याद नहीं आया और मैं कुछ भी बोलने लग गई तो मेरे दोस्त मेरा बहुत मजाक उड़ाएंगे और मेरी मम्मी की नज़रों में तो मैं गिर ही जाऊँगी पता नहीं मैं कैसे बोलूँगी मुझे तो अभी से ही धक धक हो रहा है बहुत नर्वसनेस हो रही है कॉन्फिडेंस भी नहीं है कैसे वहाँ पे बोल पाऊँगी अच्छे से कि भगवान जी बचा लेना गुड मॉर्निंग क्लास सो टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक ऑन द वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट सेशन ऑन द टॉपिक इम्पॉर्टेंट ऑफ पब्लिक स्पीकिंग यस माय डियर स्टूडेंट्स सो यू ऑल स्टडी मैथमेटिक्स यू ऑल स्टडी साइंस यू ऑल स्टडी इंग्लिश हिंदी एंड डिफरेंट सब्जेक्ट्स बट वेन इट कम्स टू पब्लिक स्पीकिंग Are you really taught in schools, or is it something that is really frightening you from inside? So today, my dear students, I am going to talk on the topic public speaking, and I will narrate a very nice story to all of you. So there was a guy named Joseph. He was in nursery class, a very tense guy, scared to face the people in the class. He was often bullied in the class because of because of his fear to not speak to his friends. to the teachers and to various other people he was bullied bullied different classes went by he was in fifth grade now a debate competition was organized by the science department he was really excited for this debate and he really wanted to participate he filled his name participated on the day of the competition he was very well ready and excited to present his debate and his point of views and then guess what happened As Joseph was very excited from inside to this debate, he got to know that some of his friends had recommended to the teacher that Joseph cannot speak well on the stage. He has a fear of public speaking, and he will not be able to deliver his point of views, and he might not be a good contestant in front of everyone. So, by convincing to the teacher, his friends got Joseph's name cancelled in the debate competition. As Joseph went on the stage, and thinking that his name would be announced, his name wasn't announced. Joseph was extremely sad, and from there his confidence literally went down that he cannot publicly speak well. Few years went by. Joseph had still the fear of public speaking instilled in his mind now, and he thought that he could never speak well on the stage. So he went to college. After two years at for placements, gave interviews and interviews, sat for JDs, sat for interviews, sat for various other rounds, and today was his 16th interview. As usual, the process of the interviews are like that: the JDs, interviews. He sat for the 16th round of interview, and his first round was micro presentation. He had to present. A idea in front of all the people that were sitting in the panelists. So there were five panelists sitting in front of him, and he had to present an idea. He was speaking confidently. He had prepared well. He had seen YouTube videos. He had learned from people how to speak publicly well. He had rehearsed and rehearsed. He had practiced a lot. And then, yes, what? Yes, he had cleared the interview. Was a 16th interview and he cleared it only with one round that was my presentation. There were other rounds for various other people, but the panelists were so impressed by his voice modulation, by his body language, by the content, by the confidence, by his expressions, by the way he spoke that he got selected into a very good company. So yes, my dear friends, I come to the end of the story. Hope you like this story and yes. The moral of the story is never lose hope. And if someone tells you that you cannot speak publicly well, that does not mean that you stop there and then. That means there is the phase that you begin this race 
of complex so what are some of the ways in which you can improve your public speaking skills number 1 know your audience yes this is a very important element if you know your audience you will be able to craft your message that resonates with them you will know what they will be able to relate with what is their level of understanding and what is their level of mindset number 2 practice practice and practice Yes, even the most eminent public speakers practice well in order to make their speech effective in front of others. And also, giving more presentations in front of others helps you in understanding whether your speech is organized and structured in a cohesive and a clear manner. Number three, body language. Yes, along with clear voice modulation, your clarity in words, your confidence. body language plays an important role your expression the way you are speaking the way you are standing the way you are using your hand movement plays a very important role while you are delivering your speech number 4 connect with your audience and give a personalized touch as we all know that good voice modulation good confidence good body language good understanding of the audience plays a vital role in a similar way you should also give a personalized touch by probably narrating a short story that everyone can relate to maybe narrating a personal story maybe narrating some jokes humor that can help people in understanding the topic well and along with that also making sure that they are not getting bored if you using a presentation make sure you add your images text infographics in an interesting manner that the audience gets attracted and yes they want to listen to you Number 5 maintain eye contact with everyone and know when your audience is about to get bored if your audience is getting bored twist your speech know some fillers that you can add in your speech so that they can get your attention well along with that confidence plays a very good role when you are delivering your speech good voice modulation good body language your facial expressions and the way you are delivering Now if you are thinking yes public speaking is so easy and yes we will develop it in a magic wand in a second it's not that easy you need to practice well if you think bollywood actors like sharukh khan deepika padukone just gave movie shots and then they got selected it's not like that they gave a lot of auditions so that they could be on the stage and be on the cinema to or and to entertain all of us so it's not that if you see some ceo like tesla ceo or if you see google ceo or if you see any famous personality or if you see a president you see us president india president they have just given speeches in seconds and they have you know cracked this art of public speaking in just a few months it's not like that they've practiced well they've participated in different forums different conferences so in the end i would like to say that to master the art of public speaking you need to practice well you need to participate in a lot of competitions if you're a school or a college student attend conferences go in forums that give you an opportunity to speak in public if you are in job give mock presentations to your colleagues give presentations to your bosses get opinion from them constructive criticism is an important element when it comes to public speaking get feedback from your colleagues get feedback from your peers get feedback from the corporate bosses that you have so that you can improve and finally master the art of public speaking i hope you like this video if you like this video do not forget to leave your comments and give us your precious feedback do like the video comment and do share and subscribe the video that's all from my side signing off with Ishanita goodbye have a nice day bye bye